for Mikey to have. Oh, Ray Rush is here. No. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Freddie the Fireman. Yeah, and I said, Tommy, all right, stack, to meet you. Hey, everybody, this is Freddie the Fireman. We're wrapping up here at Mob Movie Con. I'm here with all legends and friends of mine. I got Peter Gordy over here. I got uh, Sammy the Mayo. Start again. Start I got, again. I got, I got William, no, I got William the Mayo. Sammy the Mayo is a good friend of mine, by the way. He's the director of the Bloomfield Police Department. That's why. I, but uh, so we got William the Mayo here from Gravesend and coming up Gravesend 2. Get ready for that. We have uh, Leo Rossi. AKA Ray Rossi, and we got Bruce Soshi here, all good guys. And I'll tell you, um, I'm, I'm watching all this stuff that you're doing with Gravesend 2. I'm dying to see it. You can you give us a little update first? Yes, well, we just shot a bunch of stuff in Florida, and now we're coming back to Brooklyn to finish season two with some great people. And Exciting stuff. I'm hearing some really great stuff. I, I'm uh, a few people I know saw some little bits and clips of it, and I'm hearing it's going to be something special. And I'm really hoping that it does well for you. We added great people already, and there's more announcements of new people. But Armand Asante and William Forsythe and um, Vic Batetto, we added some great talent to uh, to us, and Andrew Dice Clay. So you can't we we stepped the bar up on with some great new additions to our cast. And Bruce. Bruce, Bruce Sosha's really in the house. You know? Yes. So what, do you, how'd you, how, what was your experience with uh, Gravesend 2? I got to be honest. One of the best film experiences I've had to date, William DeMeo is a real deal, genuine, authentic actor, producer, writer, director. He is the truth, the real deal. I, and, and he's a mentor for me. And it, it means the world to me that he believed in me enough to add me to the cast. And I had a blast. Filming with these guys, Leo Rossi, Peter Gordio, all these guys, we, we're like a family from day one, and we bond more and more every day. The show brings so much authenticity to the screen. I can't say enough about it. I'm so excited to see what we put together, and it's just the beginning. I have a feeling this is something that we're going to see for years to come. This is just the beginning. It's an amazing piece of art, and I'm so proud to be a part of it. And Leo, what do you want to say? Ditto. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, and uh, and uh, Peter, are you on it? Yeah, absolutely. It's a great cast, great series. Looking forward to season two, and the viewers are going to be just. I just want to say that um, I saw Gravesend the whole series one, and uh, I'm I'm definitely looking forward to season two. It brings you back to that '80s time growing up. It's New York, New Jersey, in my area. It's like the same stuff, you know. And with cruising, with you watching cruising, it, it was all the same stuff. It brought me back. And now that you add it, you keep upscaling the actors. Yeah, I, I just what I want to say is is that for us, and it's like a family. All the people that we work with, we're all very close we bond together we're not jealous of one another we actually root for one another and that's which we wish that's the way it's supposed to be but unfortunately it's not like that i've been in a lot of rodeos a lot of movies and uh he creates william on the set such a feeling for an actor of yeah we're all one one for all he listens he's not a screamer and uh, it means a lot to veteran actors. Well, Bruce said, we said it earlier in another interview, like when you do uh, great things with great people, only great things happen. It's about the team. It's a whole, it's everybody. Right. And we're coming from me, to have these great guys around. I'm a retired Newark fireman, and coming on the job in the, in the, in the late 80s, you had to work as a team, and, and, and that's how you get the job done. And that's how I know how to be a part of a team, and I see it, and I see it in you, and I'm, I'm really happy for you. Thank you very much. I know you don't see me as often because you're in New York, and you guys are in New York, and we're in New Jersey, but I really root for you guys because I could see that the, the love, because I know Pete, I know Pete a while, and Pete's a strong-hearted person. Bronx there. And I know anybody that Pete gets involved with, and I know you started it's, in Bronx. It's not a Facebook yeah. project. This is a project that's on a major platform, and the world is going to see what we're all about. And I'm rooting for you just so you know, all right? So God bless you, and uh, I wish you all the best, and I and I hope this, uh, we're going to do, we're doing Acho with us. Yeah, uno, yeah, due, yeah. tre, Acho, okay? On the count of three. Uno, due, tre, Acho! See Gravesend. Oh, wait, 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 don't hit nothing. Is it still running? How can we find out more about Gravesend, the website, any type of social media? Well, the first four episodes are on uh, Tubi and Amazon Prime. And now we start, once we finish season two, there'll be updates of where it's going. Oh, so to. we have two episodes up already? 
not of season two, the oh, first part. Okay. Yeah. So all right. So then there you go. And uh, like I say, let's root for it. It's going to be good stuff. And uh, thank you so much. Thank you.